until the end of the season. Well, speaking of injuries, Meredith, I know there is at least one you have to dish on today. Darren O'Day was placed on the injured list today with a right rotator cuff strain. Aaron Boone provided a little bit more information. As you see, Michael King recalled from the alternate side. And Michael King has been so good for the Yankees to start the season. Unfortunately, he was a victim of a roster crunch several times being sent back to that alternate side. But in the three appearances he made with the Yankees this year, 11 innings pitched, nine strikeouts, no runs allowed. Aaron Boone said he has been awesome. He is a better pitcher today that he was three months ago, six months ago, a year ago. They really just like the growth and the progress that Michael King has shown. As far as Darren O'Day is concerned, Aaron Boone provided a little bit more on that injury. He's kind of been cranky in the shoulder really all month. Um, started out a little bit early, he was, but able obviously to pitch through it. Um, and then actually um, the middle of the month was, was starting to feel pretty good and was kind of a non-issue and then over the last few days um it you know it still was just kind of in there cranky so decided obviously to get it looked at and and found that there was a strain in there so um you know obviously he's got to be shut down now for a few weeks Zach Britton took a step in his rehab process yesterday, throwing from the mound for the first time, 15 pitches out of him. He's not eligible to come off the injured list until the end of May. And Luis Severino threw a simulated game a couple days ago. Aaron Boone said that he'll face live hitters either May 10th or May 11th. So, Ryan, some arms may be on the way soon for the Yankees. Yeah, a couple of really talented arms there. One on the mound today, making his fifth start of the season. Jamison Tyone Meredith what's the focus for Tyone for Aaron Boone and the Yankees as he gets ready to make his fifth start. Well, at times we've seen Jamison Tyone dominate, and then there are other times where he runs into a little bit of trouble, especially second time through the order. And one thing that has really been an issue for him is putting guys away with two strikes. He'll get ahead of the count and then just can't find a way to put them away, something he reflected on after his last start. Two strike hits. That's kind of been the story of my year so far. It seems like, I, I mean, 90% of the hits I'm giving up are with two strikes. So I'm doing a good job of getting there. I feel like I'm making, you know, out of 82 pitches I threw today, I felt like I made a ton of really good ones, but you got to make the big ones when it counts. So two strikes, got to put the guy away. Um, you know, I've got the weapons to do it. Now I just have to go out there and actually follow through. You mentioned you're getting right there. How much does it eat at you that you can't put guys away? Yeah, yeah, those are the tough ones to, to swallow because, like I said, like I thought I threw the ball really well, but this is a results league and you get to two strikes and you're giving up two strike hits and, um, you know, that that's all it takes to win a game and all it takes, you know, today was a streak of three or four hitters to, to ruin our chances at a win. So happens quick. Um, you know, I think next time it'll be one of those things you get to two strikes, you get to a spot you know, a big spot in a game like that where you realize this could make or break the outing, make or break the game. You just got to put your foot on the gas and, and take care of business. And Ryan, I asked Aaron Boone about Jamison Tyone, and Boone said he likes the trajectory that he's on right now. He likes the pitches he has and the execution for the most part, with the exception of some tweaks with two strikes. But he believes that that is going to change soon. He is confident in Tyone, and they expect big things out of him this season. All right, well, we look forward to watching his start today. And for